Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. I hope you are doing well. So as you can see from the title, I am doing a monthly favourites, but I'm doing a summer holidays edition. As you may have known, I went away to Javier for a few weeks and I just wanted to showcase some of my favourite pieces that I've been absolutely loving and what I pretty much wore every day and just so over the moon with my purchases and yeah they did meet very well on holiday so I thought that would be a really good edit for my monthly favourites so let's get into it. The first off we're going to talk about makeup products or like skincare products so first off obviously of course on holiday is an essential which is SPF and I cannot rave enough about the Clarence collection all in all, this one is my favourite. This is the Sun Care Water Mist. This is a lightweight, non-greasy mist and it comes in a oil. I must say that with oils like this, they do tend to stain, but they do wash out really easily. So this is the 50, which usually I get the 30. And it sounds so silly to say and so bad for me to say, but I do like to use a lower SPF because I like to get tan and I don't very I don't tan that well and that quickly however this didn't actually affect me it worked really wonderful and gave me a really lovely long lasting tan a really nice like natural glow and i never got sunburned with it i did occasionally when we were literally sitting in the sun all day but over the overall i really didn't get sunburn and i honestly swear by the clarence spfs they also have a couple more which i'll leave down below which is a cream form they also have a face cream and also a balm which laurie really liked it's like kind of like a really non-greasy balm where you can just roll it all over your face and like over your body and where laurie has a mole on his nose it's like really good to just kind of just quickly go onto it and he preferred that to the cream as it didn't get in his eyes these are not harmful to sea animals or anything like that so yeah really enjoy these really brave about them and would really recommend them and like i said really good coverage we used one overall for three weeks for two people and then we went on to a cream so yeah for three weeks for two people that didn't do um too bad so actually i'm going to carry on with some claren theme products because i literally swear by them uh so this is the new clarence this is the new clarence aroma extraordinaire fragrance and it is so beautiful it is so stunning and it comes in this really nice like ombre bottle it's just super lightweight which i just love and what I love about it as well, it's very musky, but like it has this like zesty musk to it. It's so beautiful. And if you are looking for a fragrance, I would really recommend giving this a go. Also super lightweight, which is very handy. I think I will definitely be taking the rest of this on holiday to Brits with me because this is all in all under 100 mil. So if I keep using it, I'll only have a little bit left and I can definitely decanter that. But yeah, really love this. It's so beautiful. They also have the body moisturizer in this collection as well. And it is just wonderful. Unfortunately, I literally rinsed that product out in Spain because it just was so moisturizing to my skin. It was incredible. And also the Clarins Lip Oils. They are a huge must on holiday at home. I kindly got sent a few of these and I gave a couple of them to my friends because I really rave about them. Just want everybody to try them. So this is in the shade Pitaya. And what I love about them as well is that they are a bit of a tint. So it has like a really nice subtle colour to them. They come in a variety of colours from apricot and honey colour to like a plum colour. Very beautiful, very nourishing and hydrating. They've also been reformulated to be more friendlier to the environment and more natural ingredients, which is phenomenal. And they've just had their packaging changed. But yeah, really love these if you're looking for a lip balm. And also as well, really lovely on holiday when you don't want to carry much, you just want something to just zhuzh up your lips and look a little bit more glowy and healthy and have a little bit of a tint then definitely recommend this this is pataya by the way something that i definitely did on holiday and i was very thankful to my past self for doing this is to bring out a hair mask especially with my hair i my hair doesn't hold i have very fine thin hair and with sun damage also as well using heat tools it was very essential that i really made sure that i put some really good hydrating very protective uh, products into my hair so this is the philip kingsley elasticizer which i really recommend i 
I took, they come in different sizes. This is the one I have at the moment. I have a huge one, like a massive one you can order, which you can have at home. You can get this one and you also can get like a tube one, which I took with me. And it's just phenomenal for those days when you want to put your hair up. I used the mask as a kind of like a gel to hold my hair into place, like a hairspray. And then that also meant that as well as making a sleek hair bun, I was also putting really lovely products into my hair and giving my hair time to really soak up that mask. If we went into the sea or went into the pool, I would then quickly go for like a little shower and then I would just literally put this on my hair, chuck this on my hair, put it up and yeah, it just felt like I was giving my hair so much nourishment and moisturizer and it just smelled incredible and just felt like I was doing a little bit of wonders to my hair. So it meant that my hair was less damaged. This is a deep, deep conditioning treatment, adds elasticity and bounce to fine hair, medium and coarse hair. And yeah, it was really beautiful and very hydrating. So going on to jewelry, first off is a necklace that I generally didn't take off the whole holiday. And this is a Monica Veneda Mother of Pearl necklace. It is so stunning and I love the style of this very like rustic and very natural and I really like the gold details along here and it comes with a really nice clasp and yeah I wore it all the time I absolutely love it I think I'm actually gonna put it on now because it is very pretty and I just felt like it, it was like a really nice touch to my outfit and I just got so many compliments of it and I just think it's a very pretty accessory and very summer attire so yeah if you are looking for a summer necklace I would really recommend that this is also Monica Veneda as well I will also leave that down below and then recently actually I, I must say these probably will go into my favorites but for being at home these are the large doina huggies from Monica Venade as well which I absolutely love without further ado of course I'm going to mention my new collection with the SVP this is not a I guess I should say that this is an ad because I'm advertising my own brand but this is our new collection of my um, Amelia Taylor with SVP collection so we have the light green chastity stone and we have this ring in gold and silver which actually unfortunately I do believe it might have sold out but by the time you're watching that uh, hopefully we'll be able to do like a, a restock email um, notification but also as well it is still available in gold and silver in the white rainbow moonstone which is which is also so stunning it's my absolute favorite and that green is just so stunning it's like a gorgeous sagey turquoisey mint green really love it and if you hadn't seen my um svp collection i will leave um some videos and the highlights and instagram links down below but these are a one size ring which i think is incredible and they're adjustable but that's what i love about it as well their unique style is that they're all one size they're just adjustable with giving it a little pinch or with the ring shaper very fabulous absolutely love it so yes yeah, so i just had to mention that bikini wise i am very annoyed at myself that i have never tried a hunza g bikini before in my life i've seen everyone rave about it and i don't know why i didn't think i wouldn't like it it is the best and i will be ordering more for holidays to come they are just so fabulous again one size fits all which blows my mind but it really does and what i do really love about it as well is with the pants you can turn them into high-waisted you can turn them into low-waisted and i quite like a high rise so just under the belly and i just felt so comfortable in these really flattering and i love this color it's so beautiful and really worked well with my skin tone as you can see the next two fashion pieces are in a neutral brown color but yeah absolutely stunning so the details of this is that it's got this tortoise ring at the front of the bamboo bikini and then on the hips as well and they were just so comfortable i really really recommend hansa g i literally probably wore this the most out of all my bikinis i ordered next up it's gonna be hard to show you but i'm gonna send i'm gonna show you pictures on the side here and it's from h&m kind of like a random last minute order and i'm obsessed with it and i'm going to get the black and white because they are so timeless they're 19 pounds 99 you don't have to wear a bra with them i don't think i need to say anything else than that it is so classic so elegant and so chic and i really love these details of the ruffles you can wear them to the beach you can dress them up you can dress them down you can wear them with a blazer you can wear them with heels you can wear them with sandals some trainers it is so multi-purpose and can be worn in so many ways this summer i would really really recommend if you can 
to grab one. They are £19.99, which is fabulous. I just can see myself wearing it all the time and I just felt so lovely in them. So I'd really recommend that. Really comfortable as well and it just looked very chic. So next up is a pair of shoes and these are a new pair of shoes. These are a little bit worn but these are the flattered sandals and they are kind of like a dupe of the Hermé sandals which I do have my eye on but now having these. These are fabulous, so so comfortable, really pretty and really flattering. I just love the details of them, the quality of them. I kept to my normal size and yeah I really love these. These do come in a different array of colours but yeah I really love these, wore these all the time. I just thought they were very pretty and elegant and um, yeah went with everything. So the last thing I'm going to talk about is a book and it's called The Book, The Book Lovers which is a very cheesy rom-com book which I really hope turns into a movie because honestly I was bawling my eyes out at the end of it. It's just such an easy read, it's nothing too scary or anything too dull, anything you have to remember. It's such a proper like rom-com, it all works out in the end, it's all lovey-dovey and it's just it's such a lovely read. I'd really recommend it. It's such a beautiful one. And um, and I am meaning to find the previous book that the author wrote as well. So I'll leave that down below because I'm going to read that one next. Because like I said, I'm not a massive um, book reader as per se. But on holiday, I really like to challenge myself to read. And I did finish the book, this book, which I was very, very happy about. And I really loved it. It was a really lovely book. Really like sweet, easy to read. And yeah, I really enjoyed it. So I wanted to give that a little shout out as well. But yeah, that is the end of my summer holiday monthly favourite edition. Thank you so much for watching. I will leave everything down below so you can go and check them out. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe. It really supports my channel. Other than that, I will see you later. Bye guys.